I only want to conclude with one last act. I want to invite my brother William to come to the stage. Karibu. Don't worry, we're not singing today. You don't have to worry about that. <laughs> and as I do, I want to invite also my brother Raila and uh, Kalonzo. We have campaigned against one another. We have said nasty things about each other. We have hurt one another. On my behalf, Ndugu, I ask for your forgiveness. Yeah. And I tender my apology. <laughs> Mr. President, I thought you were going to do this on all our behalf. <laughs> so, as, the, as the, my brother President Uhuru has said, and maybe I'm the one who is most accused, <clears throat> I want my brother Stephen, on behalf of all our teams, and following in the footsteps of these great leaders, I want to say for all the things that I did say or do on behalf of all our teams, I want to ask for your forgiveness. And on my behalf, on my behalf and all those behind us, I tender my apology. Yeah. <laughs> On behalf of uh, all the members of NASA, I first want to thank my brother Hon Uhuru Kenyatta for what is just done now. But I just wanted to mention that when we, before we shook hands, we had a very long discussion. We went, we took a journey down the memory lane, where it started. And then we asked ourselves, when did the rain begin to beat us as Kenyans? And we found where the rain began to beat us, and when. And we said that we have the ability, working together, to go back down there and reunite the people of Kenya. And they said that the divisions, the hatred, the tension that has existed between our people from all those generations to now will end by with us, the two of us. <laughs> Never again shall a Kenyan die because of an election. Never again shall a Kenyan deprive a fellow Kenyan of his birthright because of an election. And we will also fight corruption together. This is the meaning of the handshake. And we are committed to ensure that the handshake and the MOU that we signed shall be completely implemented to the letter. On behalf of my team and myself, I, in front of this congregation gathered here, pray breakfast, tender my apology to my brother.
during our discussions, he accused me of having insulted him. Uh, I also told him he also insulted me. He called me Kimundu Muguruki. Apologize. Oh wow. <clears throat> Speaker Justin, you started this. <laughs> and we forgot to really say pole on the loss of your mother. It's a very difficult moment that you could even find time to stand here. We are all with you in prayer. And I think it's Senator Enhoff and Lord uh, Hastings who took it up from there. And I'll see the outcome. How I wish my brother, <clears throat> and I'll report, I think my brother Raila and I will make sure that we talk to our brothers Musali and Mudavadi and Weta. <laughs> How I wish they were here. But I'm sure they are watching. And the nation is watching. On my behalf as well, I said very hard things. In fact, it, when it comes to being angry because of political outcomes, I think I was the culprit number one. <laughs> I felt angry. And I remember now, one of the lessons I've learned is never be angry with your political competitor. It doesn't help. Neither does it help to look at history and lament over what has happened. I think it's good to look forward. And looking forward, we must all uh, continue to do. It's a great nation. President Famajo, I even gave my name, one of your clans in Somalia, that of Digli Merifli, in the hope that the Somalis can learn what is happening here in Kenya. It's a great neighbor we have, but a neighbor who is not at peace. To that extent, we cannot ourselves uh, claim to be peaceful. So as we do this, we hope, Mr. President, you have actually demonstrated leadership. And, and this resolve to fight corruption is, is absolutely unique. As my brother said, we stand with you as you make sure that every Kenyan sent. I think we should be like the Maasai and the crickets. We must look after our crickets and not even those pennies. And make sure that this nation will stand strong in the community of nations. First of all, we must get rid of this ghost go corruption in real terms and in quick time. And I think that hearing my Lord, the Chief Justice, giving that commitment to the nation, that there will be no sacred cows, that nobody will be allowed to steal anymore from the Kenyan people, is heartwarming. We will stand with you, Mr. President. My brother William, you are the hustler number one. <laughs> but a big hustler. I think you handed that over to me. I forgive you, and may God bless you. God bless you. Thank you. Thank you, brother. Thank you. Asante sana.